Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Super excited for today's video. It's all about Bobbi Brown and one of their new Sculpt and Glow palettes. So I have a blush, a highlighter, and a bronzer to try out today. So I'm gonna be swatching and pulling a look together, of course. I'm also gonna be revisiting an eyeshadow palette that I really, really like from the brand. And I'm gonna be doing my eyes for you on camera as well. Okay, so if you wanna see how this face came together and what this super bright thing is on my head, just keep watching and please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. I appreciate it when you do. Now let's jump in. Okay guys, before we jump in, of course I have to talk about my Breezy Tea products of the day. I am rocking our Honeycomb Boho Head Wrap that is just a beautiful, bright burst of color, okay? Long piece of stretchy fabric, fashion it into any style you want, dress them up, dress them down, they're awesome, okay? They come in over 20 colors and prints, so there'll be something there for everyone. My hair is still on vacation, so I wanted to just wrap my twists up today and just, you know, it still zhuzhes you up. When you don't have the time or inclination to, they're perfect. And you still look put together, even if your hair is not out or you're, you know, you're covering it completely or you're wearing it different ways, you've got options to wear it, okay? But for me, I still feel put together, zhuzhed up, even though my hair is twisted under here, okay? You would never know. All right, so if you wanna check out any of our Boho head wraps, you can visit us at breezytea.com or our Etsy shop. Links will be in the description below. Now today's all about one of the new Bobbi Brown Sculpt and Glow palettes, but I'm gonna revisit something before we get to that. I'm gonna do an eye look with you on camera with the Bobbi Brown Jade Stone uh, eyeshadow palette that I absolutely love. Just a quick reminder if you saw that video and if you didn't, you can see what it looks like inside. This is such a beautiful palette. It's one I've really come to love. The shadows are really pigmented and just so smooth and they're just beautiful on. And the first time I focused mostly on the green because that's what really stood out. So I'm gonna try to do something simple and easy, uh, a look now just to go with what we got going on today. So let's, let me pull these eyes together with this Jade Stone palette. I'm telling you guys, if you haven't tried it out, I don't even know if it's still available. It's a really, really pretty um, palette with some really interesting colors and uh, you have a lot of options here. 
You have a lot of options here. You can go more green, you can go more warm. There's lighter colors you can play around with for now. Like, I really, really enjoy this palette. But that's it, we've done the eyes. Let's get to the main event. So here is the Bobbi Brown Sculpt and Glow Palette in Medium. Now this is what's interesting. This is cloth, it actually feels really cool. This is a nice cloth uh, fabric covering it. We've got a peachy uh, color. Inside we have Afternoon Glow, which I'm assuming is the highlighter. We've got Desert Peach, the blush, and then Medium, uh, the Medium Bronzer, okay? That's looking pretty light. But I'm gonna swatch it against another Bobbi Brown bronzer that I have, um, and we'll see. And um, yeah, I'm excited, so let's swatch this. I'm up to my bronzer uh, portion of events. Okay, so here is the medium bronzer, okay? It looks much lighter than it swatches in the pan, okay? So there's like almost a rosiness to it on me. There's a little bit of a undertone going on so we'll we'll see how this works out and this is a perfect time to remind you that i will always have swatches on my instagram page okay a couple of days after a video goes live here on youtube i will have swatches in sunlight video swatches and photo swatches for you all right you can get a better look a closer look at the swatches so come follow me on instagram i'm also going to be sharing like it, when i see that there are things coming up i'll always share uh, upcoming releases and stuff like that um, that I see and I'll repost and stuff like that. Speaking of which, I got some really fun videos coming up. Uh, Europe has been having some amazing deals and I've taken advantage of it. So I have a Chanel nail polish video coming up. I have um, some Guerlain. I have some Givenchy. I have um, Viseart. Uh, just different things, some Tom Ford. Uh, Hermes will be soon. I've got some YSL uh, also. So really good deals that I found. I'll talk about them in the individual videos, but that's something to look forward to and something I'm always sharing on my Instagram page. So come by, stop by, see what I have going on and follow me. Okay, so I've got some products on the brush. Let's get this uh, bronzer on the cheeks, okay? There are three different um, palettes. There's a lighter one. And then there's a deeper one. I have medium. I thought about the deeper one, but the issue was for me, I didn't want a, um, I'm like, I'm paused on like golden highlights, highlighters. So I, that was really it. I was like, the blush looked good. Obviously the, the color of the bronzer would be good, would work on me, even if it's just a little bit darker than I normally have. But it was really that highlighter. I don't know if you're like me. Are you over gold highlighters? There will be a time somebody's going to come out with something that I'm going to probably grab. But I just was like, eh, things have come out. And I'm, I've been intentionally choosing the alternative colors, okay? This baked formula always makes it a little more, you know, adds a, just a little bit more work to get the color uh, off the thing. But it's showing up on me absolutely uh, yeah, and this is more than enough, okay? So this is the bronzer portion, the bronzer of the Bobbi Brown Sculpt and Glow 2023 palette, um, spring, I'm gonna say spring, summer palette. So we've got the bronzer on. Let me quickly swatch this, the other one I have, the bronzer against this one. So here I have the Bobbi Brown bronzing powder. This one is in deep which is really too dark for me. This is it, okay? And I really need a light touch when I use this one. Um, I got this, this is one of maybe the one of the first bronzers I got, and um, so it was too dark for me. I don't know why I've never gone back, because I really love the bronzer, but I, I've never gone back and gotten a lighter shade, but this is the one in the palette, the medium, and this is the deep, okay? So that's where we are, just wanted to show you that. Let's get to the cheeks. So here is the highlighter. It's called Afternoon Glow and two for two on softness. These swatch like a dream. Both of them are so soft. This is beautiful. There's a rosiness to it. That's very, very pretty. And yeah, I'm excited to try this on. So we're two for two. Let's get this on my cheeks, okay? And this is it right here. Beautiful, beautiful color. I don't know, it just, it just interested me more than a, than a gold one. I don't want to 
do too much. I know how I am with a highlighter. So I'm going in with highlighter first. And then I don't know who I saw that tip uh, with. Um, maybe it was Gucci Westman that I saw at one time. It just made me do this first and then do the blush over it, which I really, really like. Very, very pretty. Nice glow. It's a beautiful, beautiful highlighter, and I forgot I didn't put any in my brow bone. So perfect. I didn't put anything in my brow bone. So I'm gonna just jazz this up here, wearing it perfectly. It's working, it looks beautiful, and it's brightening this area and giving a little pizzazz. Plus, you look, plus it'll match uh, my, my cheeks. Very, very pretty. I, I don't know, it's the beauty industry is doing it for me with these palettes. I just, it's just so easy. Palettes are just, just so easy for me, so. I'm quite the fan right now, and it looks like this is gonna continue, okay? With these palettes coming out, and these multi-use palettes and all that stuff. Next up, Desert Peach. That's the blush color. It's giving more coral to me, okay? Maybe that's the desert in the color. <laughs> it's giving me more coral. I'm gonna use my Chikaho, though, uh, Zen Cheek Brush, and get some of this on my cheeks. Let's see how much it picks up this brush and how much I can get from it. Again, the formula, I'm getting it. Very pretty, I love a, this is a very pretty, I, I like a coral. I think this year I'm going to, uh, did I not show you the, did I show you the damn, did I show you the swatch? Let me stop mid-go just in case. Here it is here, beautiful, beautiful shade, really, really pretty color. If I showed it to you, this would be edited out, so. You won't be seeing this part. Back to these cheeks. I think I'm just loving like these orangey colors on me in the, ooh, that's giving baby Jane. Oh no, it's just the ship. It's still the lights hitting it. Doesn't look that, doesn't look as rosy as I, corally as I thought. But I will pull that back, okay? Still needs to look not too much. But I think this, this color is beautiful for my skin. I think these colors complement my medium um, skin tone really, really nicely. Let me pull this blush back a little bit. Another brush because it's pretty, but just a bit much on me. Use this up here on the nose. So yeah, let me know how you feel about palettes and these, um, multi-use things and are they more convenient for you? Do you prefer convenience over all the individual stuff? Listen, I like the different things, but I'm just really enjoying palettes right now because they're coming out with really good ones, right? So that is the pretty coral face. It's giving me a face full of warm weather goodness. And yeah, here we go. Let me put on a lipstick. Okay, so I threw on a lip gloss I thought would look nice. And a reminder, uh, as always, that everything that I'm wearing on my face will always be in the description below. Things that I feature and then the things I don't feature, like this lip gloss or my foundation or the powder I'm wearing, okay? All that stuff will always be in the description uh, below. There will be some affiliate links and I appreciate you if you are gonna buy it anyway and you wanna use one of my affiliate links, I really do appreciate it. So again, there are three of them. There's one that's lighter, one that's darker. I'm wearing the medium one, so you have something to play with. So yeah, I really enjoyed it. Sophisticated finishes um, uh, that I really, really like. Everything can be built up how you like it. Um, so I'm a fan. Uh, and that's it for me, it's over to you guys. Let me know if you liked how this palette looked on me. Let me know 
If this is something you're interested in getting, do you love Bobbi Brown products? Let me know all those things in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. I appreciate it when you do. And if you wanna check out any of our boho head wraps, any of our t-shirt hair towel wraps, sandline beanies, sandline knit beanies, and all our other hair accessories, just visit us at brizzytea.com. For all our luxury lifestyle accessories, you can visit us at fraybybrizzytea.com. I will check you guys in the next video. Ciao for now, bye.